So this next ASMR is called Baking Co Cookies with Your Girlfriend Christmas ASMR Roleplay. I know what some of you people might be thinking. Faith, aren't you straight? Yes, I am straight. But I thought it would be a good idea to add some female ASMRs in here because, well, I'm very supportive of, supportive of the LGBTQ community. So, I thought this would be good. I mean, she looks really cute. She looks like a really adorable little... <sighs> she looks like a really cute high school girl. And like, about my age, 16. So like, if I was attracted to women, I would definitely date her. She's like a really attractive anime girl. I know what you're probably gonna say. Faith, she's anime. So what? Okay, so I'm gonna give her a name. I'm gonna call her Miku, because she looks like Hatsu Miku, only her eyes are orange and not green like the actual pop star. So, Miku it is. Hey, sleepyhead. Hi, Miku. It's almost 10. Yeah? We have a lot to do today. Actually, it would be, according to my phone, since my computer is one hour behind, it's actually 3.51. So, close, but no cigar. Come on, get up. I'm a, I am up, I'm recording a video. Oh, hey, that's cheating. Did I, like, pin her down or something? Huh. Never really thought about being the top if I was in a relationship with a girl. I usually think that I was on the bottom, but... Meh. You can't pull me back to bed. <laughs> it's Christmas. Yes, I can. We have gingerbread cookies to bake. Gingerbread cookies? Okay, Miku, then let's get the fuck out of bed. <laughs> hey, patting my head is double cheating. How is it double cheating? I be lucky that I'm not pinching your cheeks right now because you are just you're adorable! How are we gonna get up now? Um, uh, just get up. Hmm, it is awfully comfy. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's okay if we stay in bed just a little longer. Since you're such a sleepyhead. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly. It really looks like we'll be snowed in, doesn't it? Um, actually, no, it doesn't. It's... <sighs> it's just dead grass, dead everything here. It really looks like we'll be snowed in, doesn't it? I guess so. It's a blizzard out there. No, no it isn't, sweetie. Such a pretty white landscape. <laughs> I wish. Getting snowed in isn't so bad if it's with you. Oh. It's actually pretty cozy. You're actually Almost like we can pretend the rest of the world doesn't exist. You are actually melting my heart right now. Mm. Stop being so goddamn cute. Like it's just you and me. Uh -huh. You and me forever, me uh, Miku. To be honest, there isn't anyone else I'd rather be snowed in with. Oh, oh you think so too, huh? Yeah. <laughs> that makes me happy. Oh. I have a surprise downstairs for you. Ooh, surprise! Um, is it a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh cards? Is it a bunch of Pokemon cards? Is it new data for my phone? Is it a GoPro? Is it an actual vlogging camera? Is it a... Uh... Oh, is it more Adam Sandler movies? Oh, baby, you're the best! I call her babe. She's, do she's not real. Hmm. You know what, whatever. Miku's adorable. I have, I have the right to call her sweetie, honey, and babe. 
look at that face. You tell me that if you were attracted to women, or if you're a guy watching this and you are attracted to her, you would hold her and protect that smile. Look at that smile. You would want to protect it. I am going to protect that smile. Yes, really. Aww. Does that make you want to get out of bed? <laughs> yes, yes it does. Okay, sleepyhead. Let's go. Okay. It is Christmas after all. Yep. How could I not get you a surprise? Aww, you're too sweet, sweet. <laughs> yep, that's it. Go ahead, open it. Oh, I'm excited. What is it? 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 Ah, I'm so happy you like it. Oh. I know you've been wanting one for a while. A GoPro? It was a little hard to come by, but nothing I couldn't handle. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you got something for me too? I gotta return the favor somehow. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't be so surprised, huh? Of course not. It is Christmas after all. Well, duh. But just getting to spend time with you was enough of a present for me. Oh. Miku, you remind me so much of Serenity from Yu-Gi-Oh! Like... I guess I'll open it now. Do it, 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 do it. Oh my gosh! How did you know I've been wanting this figure? It's a limited edition and everything. Well, I mean, it was a little bit hard because the mall was jam packed, and uh, yeah, I had to spend basically a hundred bucks in, Chris in birthday money. But hey, I got it for you. Merry Christmas! I barely know how to thank you. You don't have to thank me. This is such a rare collectible. <laughs> and I thought my gift was good. Aww. Thanks so much, darling. Oh, of course. I'll find a way to repay you. Maybe with the cookies. Yes, repay me with cookies. Speaking of... Don't you think we should get started on those? Yeah, let's do it. We should have everything we need. Okay. I took everything out of the cupboards this morning. Good, good girl. Let's see. Can you grab two big mixing bowls? I'll turn on Got the it. oven. Thanks, dearie. Sure thing. <laughs> Two mixing bowls coming right up. Eee! I'm sorry, usually I wouldn't be reacting this way, but like, come on! She's adorable! How could I not? Like, mm, I just really pinch your cheeks and protect the smile! Miku! Miku! You are everything. <laughs> you are everything that a guy could ever want. Sweet. Knows how to bake. Knows how to get the perfect gift. Like, seriously. If you were real, any guy would be lining up and practically kiss the ground that you walk on. Like, worship you. Because you are just a pure little angel. Sifting the flour is kind of a pain, but... Yeah. It really helps with the cookie's texture. It, yeah, just a little cookie 101 from Faith the Hedgehog. Sifting the flour can basically help with the texture. It can make it more soft, it can make it more, a bit more crumbly. Unless, of course, you want more crisp, uh, crispy cookies. So you kind of have to pack the flour into the, you know, the measuring cups. Also, if you want your cookies to turn out just right, don't pack in the flour. I learned that last year in a culinary class. 
So, um, yeah, thanks, Teach. So, we'll just have to put up with it. Yeah. Here, you hold the sifter and I'll pour the flour in. Okay. One cup. Two cups. Okay. Three cups. Four cups. Oh my, I thought, we, are we, how many cookies are we making? Uh, what number was I on again? Four. Oh, right, thanks. No problem. Five cups and six cups. How many cookies are we making? This is a lot of flour. How many cookies does this recipe make again? I have no idea. You were the one that you know, put six cups in the bowl, honey. Now we can add the baking powder okay. and the cinnamon, nutmeg, ginger, and clove. Ooh, these are going to be some bomb Thank cookies. You. These will be super tasty. <sighs> I'll bet. Now we can do the wet ingredients. Can you measure out the shortening and crack the egg? Yeah. I'll add the brown sugar, molasses, and water. Okay. <laughs> Great! We're almost ready to bake them now. Yay! Let's see. So we'll add the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients and then mix. Okay. You can handle it, right? <laughs> Sure thanks. Don't say thanks before we finish. Whoa, you're stirring really fast. Yeah, Markiplier speed. Hmm, no. It's okay as long as you don't spill anything. Good. I just didn't realize you were such a pro stirrer. <laughs> well, you know me. Huh? Okay, it looks good. Now we get to roll them out. Let's sprinkle the counter with flour. Okay. And don't forget to coat the rolling pin in flour too so they don't stick. Exactly! And I'll roll out the dough until it's about... this thick. Ooh, this is gonna be delicious. Now for the shapes. <laughs> I really wanna make gingerbread people. Oh, I just cool. think they're so cute and... We can even decorate them to look like us. Aww. Here are the cutouts I got. <laughs> cute, right? Yeah, very cute. But they're gonna look even cuter once I make them look like you. You can cut them out and put them on this baking sheet. Aye, aye, Captain. Wow, you're really good at this. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> I'm in well, I mean, I don't mean to brag, but I do happen to make some pretty damn tasty cookies. Just ask anyone who's tried them. Outside of my family, I mean. Pressed. I think they're ready to go in the oven now. Ooh, I can't wait. Now we wait for ten minutes. Okay. What should we do for the next 10 minutes? Hmm. Well, for these 10 minutes, maybe I could either make you get Rick rolled. Nah. Or we could t we could play just dance. You know, that video game? Yeah. Maybe we could sit by the fire and watch the snow fall? Mm, that too. Let's do that. You want to? Yeah. <laughs> that makes me happy. Oh, anything to make you happy, Miku. I brought a blanket. Yeah, of course we're going to share. <laughs> I need you under here to warm me up. Well, of course I'll warm you up. You come here.
This is nice. Yeah. The snow is almost the prettiest thing here. Almost. Yeah, prettiest thing is you. After me, obviously. <laughs> okay, that was a bit vain, but I'm gonna forgive you for that. I'll, I'll let this one slide. I'm just kidding. Of oh. course it's you. Don't be silly. Aww, thank you. That's so kind of you. I feel like I could sit here all day with you. Yeah, it's nice. Maybe we should. I guess we don't have anything else planned after the cookies. Not really, no. We could play some video games too. Yeah, let's do that, let's do that. Uh, has it really been 10 minutes already? I guess, unfortunately. I don't want to leave this blanket. <laughs> Having your arms around me is so nice. Yeah. But, you know what else is nice? Cookies are nice. Hmm. Yeah. I got some icing and candies to decorate them with. Let's decorate together. Yeah, let's decorate together. Wouldn't it be fun if we made them look like us? Honestly, I just want to say this right now. She does kind of look like she's made out of candy. You know what I mean? Like that heart here is like a little like hot tamale candy or something. And then her eyes are like honey and then her hair is basically like like blue icing and just all around she looks like a little cookie and you just gobble up it <laughs> here I think this cookie is perfect for you thank you see it looks just like you right <laughs> I guess it does hey. you even got my uh frizzy as hell hair my Big nerdy glasses, my uh, baby 12 year old face, even though I'm 16. Hey, don't look at me like that. It does look just like you. Come on now. And this one's perfect for me. Yeah. See how much cuter it is than yours? Oh, <laughs> you stinker. This color is pretty good for your hair, right? I guess, if you just, um, <laughs> if you just dye the icing poop brown, then I guess it'd be good. And this pink icing is perfect for mine. Actually, it would be blue, sweetie. It would be a blue icing, not, not pink. Your bows and mittens, maybe, but not your head. Oh, how about you draw my hair and I'll draw yours? Uh, I don't know how you're gonna, you know. Here, how does down. this look? Perfectly frizzy. What? Is that really what you think my hair looks like? Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Mm, I can't tell if you're bullying me or if you're just that bad at decorating cookies. Have you know that I am a cookie artist, sweetheart? So don't come at me with all that. Well, I'll need eyes too. Well These little candies are pretty good, right? Yeah. We can just glue them down with some icing. Oh, we need clothes, huh? I guess, yeah. It would be cute if we put us in matching sweaters, right? Oh my god! Such a couple Red things. is perfect, and maybe we can decorate it with crushed candy canes. Ooh, great idea. But this time I'm doing my own cookie. Yeah, do that. I think they're almost done. Mm -hmm. We need smiles, though. Yeah. Just gotta draw your cutie little smile. Some pink frosting would be cute. Yeah. Hey, don't
don't draw yourself frowning. Oh, I know you're not really sad on Christmas. So make your cookie match how you're feeling. Mm, okay. <laughs> you. That's better. Hmm, they look pretty good. But I think they're missing something. Mistletoe? They're just not realistic enough, you know? Blush? I really wanted them to look like us. Hmm. Hey, maybe it would help if we add some more personal details. Like? You know that freckle on your arm? If we use just a little chocolate, we can add one that looks just like it, right here. Several freckles on my arms. You know what would really help? What? Some hair, just like yours. And it makes sense to use your hair, right? I guess, yeah. Hold still. Wait, you're not putting hair on the cookie, are you? Just a little of your hair is enough. On the cookie? And, of course, we'll do some of my hair, too. Are you insane? They're better already. Me But I think we can go further. Don't say you're gonna cut our arm and put blood on the cookie. That, that, that just seemed a little bit sketch. I mean, like, the mole, like, the freckle on my arm, it, it's fine, but the hair? On the cookies. That's kind of weird, man. It's really about the little details when you're trying to make something as realistic as possible. I guess, but why the hair? Like, fingernails. No, not fingernails. What the fuck? Fingernails are a great detail. What are you thinking? I actually saved some of yours from the last time you cut them. That's not creepy at all. Okay, Miku. I was really starting to think you were cute. And question my sexuality. But, hair and fingernails? No, 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 no. You don't do that on cookies. They're in this little baggie. See, I always plan ahead. <laughs> you... You... Saved all of my fingernails. Okay, um... That's a whole lot of nope. I kept some of mine, too. We can just add them to the cookies right at the end of the arms. Are you fucking insane? Oh, that's wonderful, don't you think? That's fucking creepy! And I think just one more detail will really make them. Don't say blood. If you say blood, we're done. We are fucking done. Miku, if you say that you need to cut my arm, and put blood on the cookie, we are over. No more of this, understand? Just a drop of blood. Called it! I fucking called it! I literally called it. Nope, yep, we're breaking up. You don't mind, right? Yes, I fucking It won't mind. even hurt. Are you? I got these sterilized needles from work. Can I see your finger? You're not gonna fucking see my finger, bitch. Just a little prick. And a little squeeze onto your cookie. Excellent. I'll do mine too. Oh, you want a closer look at my cookie? Yeah, of course. It should be dry by now, so you can pick it up. down. Uh, I felt your hands. When you picked up the cookie, I felt your hands on me. What the fuck? Darling, I think we've made a mistake. No shit! Can you feel this? 
I I didn't think I didn't think this stuff was real. I didn't think it would really work. I just thought it would be interesting to see. I didn't think about what would happen if it were real. Then why the fuck did you add hair, fingernails, and blood? I think we shouldn't eat these cookies. No shit, Sherlock! I think we need to keep them very safe. But I don't know what will happen when they start to rot. We would probably die. Um... Okay. So, this ASMR, it turned out really sweet. I was really starting to like Miku. She was just like a cute little girlfriend that I could just like, you know, hold and cuddle. But then she started talking about putting hair, putting fingernails, putting blood on the cookie. I'm like, honey, you can't do that. It's a cookie. You eat it. You don't put your body parts on it. What's next? You want me to cut my, cut the tip of my finger off and then place it on the, on the crotch of the, my cookie? Frick, that was... I'm guessing a yandere voodoo girl? I did not expect that. Let's move on to the next video. Oh, oh god. Okay, so this next video is called Home for Christmas LGBTQ Girlfriends. Now, this goes out to, like, lesbian or... Yeah, lesbian couples. So let's get this started. Okay, so the full video is called ASMR Roleplay Home for Christmas LGBTQ Girlfriends Erotic Preview Hiding from the Family. Ah, oh, sweet lord, it's gonna be. It's gonna be 18 and up. So, kitties, if you wanna, you know, not watch this. Because your parents would probably call the police on me. Um, <laughs> you will have to skip to the next ASMR thumbnail, like, until you don't see this anymore. Okay, so I'm gonna make up a name for her. Um, let's just call her Lost Narrator. Or Lost. Because she literally looks like the lost narrator. Yeah, let's do that. Hey babe, where'd you say the bathroom was again? It even sounds like her a little bit. Down the hall and to the right. Okay. I, do you think you could show me? Yeah, sure. No problem. I, yes, you did say down the hall and to the right. But, you know, it's a big new house and I want to be sure. Yeah. Okay, um... I'm guessing this one is bad at directions. Oh, well, at least you're not psycho like Miku was. Ah, our relationship. It was kind of rocky in the beginning. She always had murderous intentions, but... It really blew up. Uh, like, our relationship really blew up when she asked to cut my hair, get my toenails, and put a drop of my blood on a Christmas cookie. That looks a lot like me. So yeah, Lost, I'm, I'm glad that you could be the one for me after Miku was sent to Arkham Asylum to get herself treated. <laughs> oh, no, thanks. No, 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 no it, it, it's fine. Nobody needs to get up from the table or anything. I can, uh, you know, I, I think we can figure it out on our own. Thank you, though. Right. Come on, babe. Uh, lead the way. Alright, follow me, sweetheart. Lost. <laughs> oh, okay, over to this right, gotcha. Yeah, no, 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 I, I suspected that that was the thing. Come here. Come here, okay. Listen. You are not okay. You're not. Don't look at me like that. I know that you're not okay. I can see the way that you're scowling. You're looking at your plate. You're not even touching your food. You're pissed. I get it. Well, yeah, I'm thinking about my recent breakup with Miku. That's why I'm pissed. No need to rub it in my face, Lost. Babe, we are invited to a Christmas dinner by your homophobic parents who are acting like I'm your roommate and not your living girlfriend and it's pissing you off and I understand, okay? You're stressed, you're freaking out, and I'm completely sympathetic to the situation. So I needed to get you out of there. 
She'll, they'll know what we're doing. She, she, your mom? Your mom will know it? Your, your dad? Who cares? Babe, who the fuck cares? Who cares what we're doing in here? Because you know what? In about 30 seconds, when I pin you to this wall, you're gonna be right. No, 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 no. Don't pull away. No, 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 don't. Don't pull away. Don't pull away. Babe, listen to me. Oh, boy. <laughs> Now in this one, I really am the submissive one in this relationship. Holy God. You need an orgasm about as badly as anything else I've seen before right now. Um. Um. Uh. <laughs> I'm acting like a shy anime schoolgirl. Like, uh, orgasm? I need an orgasm? Um, how are you gonna do that, Lost? Yeah. You know what? They are gonna know what we're doing in here. Oh, I hope they know what we're doing in here. My dad, let him walk in and see you trying to make me orgasm. He is going to kill you and then me. Oh boy. Let someone come into this bathroom and see us making out. Just let us come, let someone come into this bathroom. Not that I don't mind. <laughs> So here's the challenge, sweetheart. What? I am going to fuck you in this closet. What the f and you have to keep your voice down, because one way or the other, it is happening. Oh, sweet Jesus! <laughs> oh, boy! <laughs> okay! I can do that! No problem! You don't want to. You don't feel like it. Are you honestly trying to tell me that this Christmas season, this holly jolly time of year, in this house, with these family members, is totally okay if I never touch you? Because, babe, you and I both know that I'm very familiar with this skirt. And even though I can bring my hand up your thigh, I can bring my hand up your thigh, and around the curve of your inner thigh, Oh, I can feel this moisture right here. <laughs> can you? Babe, you want this as badly as I do. You want it as badly as I want to give it to you. So I'm going to tell you again. You need to keep quiet or they're going to find us in here. And the longer that we delay, the more obvious it becomes. Uh. Come on, girl, let me touch that.